Hey friends, welcome back to my channel, Organized with Joy, and welcome to another Thoughtful Thursday video. In today's video, I'm going to be cleaning out my pantry, and you might notice that it is fairly organized and it doesn't look too messy, but sometimes I just like to go in there and clean up and make sure there's nothing that is expired or anything that we're no longer using. That is the beauty of having a pantry that has an organization system that works well is that it makes it really easy to clean it out when that time comes. But everyone needs to clean out their pantry every once in a while. I also picked up some groceries this morning, so I have some things that I know need to go ahead and put away and decant, but I thought I would take you along while I did that and I will be discussing some sort of topic. I don't even know what the topic will be yet. I have some ideas, but I'm not for sure which topic I'm gonna discuss in my next Thoughtful Thursday video. So please enjoy this motivation of cleaning out my pantry. So for today's Thoughtful Thursday video, I wanted to talk about removing limiting beliefs from your thoughts. I kind of feel like that term removing limiting beliefs may be overused these days, but I'm not sure how else to express what I mean. When I say removing limiting beliefs, what I mean to say is to stop making excuses or believing you can't do something and therefore you don't even try. I know there are some things that might truly be impossible. Maybe you have physical or mental limitations that prevent you from doing certain things, but I'm not talking about those things. I'm talking about the things you know deep down that you can change, but you don't because it's hard work and it's outside of your comfort zone. Most of the time, people live their lives inside of their comfort zones, unwilling to try something that's difficult. We tell ourselves internally the things we believe about ourselves, and that limits us from being more. Oftentimes, we play tapes in our heads that were dropped there in childhood. We believe certain things about ourselves because of what we were told instead of what is actually true. Stop allowing other people to tell you who you are. Stop allowing other people to dictate what you can and can't do. It can help to acknowledge that those beliefs you have about yourself may be from childhood trauma or wounds. Acknowledging this can help you to recognize that they are just not true. Sometimes we don't change or grow or do better because we believe essentially lies about who we are. When we hear those things in our head that tell us we're not good enough, we don't have enough time, we don't have the resources to accomplish what we want to accomplish, we need to stop ourselves and speak something different. Say it out loud if you have to. Tell yourself that you can. You may need to take baby steps to get there, but you can get there. One way to stop believing the beliefs that limit us is to choose to do hard things. Push yourself outside of your comfort zone on a regular basis. Choose to challenge yourself instead of allowing yourself to live in the status quo. Another thing you can do is remind yourself that failure is okay. Tell yourself that you will be okay even if the worst case scenario happens. We have to be willing to risk failing in order to try hard things or things that are outside of our comfort zone. Risking failure and failing is far better than not taking the risk at all. There is a chance you will risk failure and succeed, and I think that's worth the risk. What limiting beliefs do you hold about yourself today? How can you challenge that limiting belief so that you can become better and so that you can grow? I hope these thoughts today were encouraging or inspiring to you. Please let me know your thoughts down in the comments below. And I hope that you'll watch the rest of this pantry clean out for the remainder of the video.
town In a place where no one cares enough to die Too busy questioning myself to ask them why
Well, that is all I have for you in today's video. I hope it was motivational and inspiring. If you're new to my channel, every Thursday I share some thoughts and some motivation at the same time. If that's something that interests you, I hope that you might consider subscribing to my channel. But thanks for watching until the very end, and I will see you in the next one. Bye.